वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग वेलकम टू द लेक्चर सीरीज आर एफ डिजाइन क्लास बी इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड टेलीकम्युनिकेशन सेम एट मुंबई यूनिवर्सिटी मॉडल नंबर थ्री फ्रीक्वेंसी जनरेशन एंड मिक्सर इन दिस लेक्चर आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन द वेरियस टाइप्स ऑफ मिक्सर्स सो द मिक्सर्स इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी डिफाइन मिक्सर इज ए थ्री पोर्ट नेटवर्क इन विच वी जनरेट्स ए वेरियस फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ रेंजेस विथ देयर हारमोनिक प्रोडक्ट्स सो मिक्सर में भी इट टेकन द इनपुट फ्रॉम टू पोर्ट एंड प्रोड्यूस आउटपुट एट वन पोर्ट we also see the characteristics of the mixer various characteristics of the mixer which will be help to design a mixers sub so, as a up conversion down conversion conversion loss noise figure in double sideband and single sideband in concept as well as we define some other characteristics which are important in terms of the isolation today we'll deal with the various types of mixer single ended diode mixer fet mixers balance mixers and image radiate mixers and also another types of the mixer so today we'll first see the single ended diode mixer in single diode ended mixer it called as a single ended mixer because it use a single diode element first we see the block diagram of single diode ended mixer so it consists of duplexing coupler dc block rf choke diode and low pass filter so first we draw first element that is Duplexing coupler. First input is a RF input. That is V RF voltage. Second input, a local oscillator input with voltage. v of t then output which is fed back to the dc choke dc block then rf choke rf choke provided with the dc biasing voltage this diode is biased on a dc voltage so here single ended diode then ground will be provided here diode then again dc block then we see a low pass filter low pass filter and the output is comes of current which will be measured intermediate frequency current if output is a sinusoidal wave so this is the figure a which shows a circuit for a single 
and it mixer then we see the idealized equivalent circuit for the single ended mixer which will be show in the figure here are the two inputs one from the rf input and second one from the local oscillator which is connected these two inputs given to the a dc bias in diode this is a current flowing in terms of time domain so this is the voltage across diode so figure b it idealizes equivalent circuit so a basic diode mixer circuit as shown in figure a this type of mixer is called single ended mixer because it consists only single diode single diode element the rf and lo local oscillator input are combined which is applied to the diode mixer which is superimposed to input voltages vrf and va vlot to drive this diode the demultiplexing function can be implemented using directional coupler or hybrid junction to provide a signal combining as well as the isolation between the two inputs so this demultiplexing function can be implemented with the directional coupler as well as the hybrid junction the main objective to provide the isolation between these two frequencies rf input and local oscillator input then diode may be biased with the dc bias voltage so dc biasing voltage is provided through rf choke voltage which must be decoupled from the rf signal path this is done by using dc blocking capacitors or either side of the diode and with the rf choke between diode and bias voltage so rf this rf choke is present between the dc bias voltage and diode the ac output of a diode is passed through the which produces this diode processes the ac output voltage which is passed through the low pass filter to provide a desired intermediate frequency output this description for the application for the down converter but same mixer will be used for the up conversion each port may be used interchangeably as a input and output port so when we changing this output input port we get up conversion this is an example of down conversion down converter mixer but the same mixer can be implemented as a up conversion or up converter just interchange the input and output the ac equivalent circuit will be shown here which will be see where rf and local input voltages represent two series connected voltage in source let rf be the input voltage in the cosine wave form so first voltage which is to be written write down so rf input voltage b cosine wave form 
of frequency that is omega rf we can write down omega rf and which is given by equation instantaneous voltage vrf into t vrf cos omega rf into t this is equation number 1 let input local oscillator input voltage be cosine wave frequency wave frequency that is the frequency of the oscillator which is omega lo so instead in as our peak voltage instead in as voltage value that is lo cos omega r into t this is equation number second by using small signal approximation which gives the total current flowing through the diode so total current flow through the diode which is shown in this figure equivalent is that is i of t so we can write i of t is equal to so i of t is equal to i0 plus g of d v r f t plus v l of t into g dash v r f t plus v l of t whole square first term the first term in equation 3 this dc bias current so this is a dc bias current dc bias current which is blocked by the by the if output dc blocking capacitor the second term reflection of the rf and local input signals so this is the reflection of your rf and local oscillator input which filtered only by the low pass filter low pass if filter leaves the third term which is can be written using trigonometric identities so first term is dc bias current which is blocked by the dc capacitor second term is a reflection of your two signals like rf input and local oscillator input and third one which is written in terms of the trigonometric function so i of t is equal to g dash of d divided by 2 v rf we can put the values of this vrf and vlt from the equation 1 and 2 so we can get into t plus vl of t cos omega of t by applying trigonometric laws we get
mi r f square cos square r f into t plus 2 v r f v l o cos omega r f into t plus cos omega l into t so v l o into square plus cos square omega l o into t square so d dash 4 is equal to divided by put v r f square 1 plus cos omega r f into t plus v l o square 1 plus square bracket 1 plus cos 2 l o into t we can put here the trigonometric equations and 2 v r f v l o cos omega r f minus omega l o into t plus 2 v r f v l o cos omega r f plus omega l o into t so this is the complete equation this result seen the contains the several new signal components after solving this equation only one of which produces the desired intermediate difference product the two dc terms is again will be blocked by the blocking capacitor and the 2 rf and 2 omega lo and 2 rf plus omega lo terms will be blocked by the low pass filter will lose only one if current so if output current if output current so these terms first one second one and this third one are blocked by the low pass filter only i f output current as so i i f in time domain g of t is equal to divide by 2 v r f v l o into cos v i f into t so this is equation number 4 so where this intermediate frequency intermediate angular frequency is a combination difference between angular frequency of the radio frequency minus angular frequency of the oscillator that is local oscillator l o so this is the function of the this is the spectrum for the down consumer single ended mixer identical to the idealized mixer which is shown in figure so here will be defined the concept of single ended diode mixer which only provides the a intermediate frequency because it was a down conversion or down converter so this is the first type single ended mixer why it is called single ended mixer because it is consist only a single diode so that is called as a single ended mixer so in this lecture we see the various types of mixers and then we study the single ended diode mixer so we can stop here thank you very much